Thanks, and it's Saturday night. So we're at the booth. <coughs> Added in a few things. Added that mirror. Windows, chair, and the bench. If I paid more, I'd be okay with it. Yeah. Night back from the antique mall. On the way home from the antique mall, we got a call from the antique mall, <laughs> and somebody made an offer on those. Um, the two cabinets that we literally, 30 minutes before, they had been separated in the booth and we put them together and boom, they sold. So this is what's going on. Cabinets have been delivered. We're getting them painted and tomorrow our dude is coming to install them. So we got a lot of painting ahead of us. I'll be checking in with you throughout the evening and show you what's going on. hard all right this piece has had two coats we're gonna go ahead and put it up that way and if it needs any touch up after it's on the wall then we'll do it at that time this i just painted the first coat honey's got all the drawer faces and the cabinet doors off because he's going to spray those tomorrow Here's all the rest of the cabinets. Well, this isn't all the rest of the cabinets. He's bringing some more tomorrow. Look, that one goes over there. <laughs> oh my God. I've been up since 524. I'm tired, guys. But I'm so happy we sold something at the Armadillo today. And now I'm going to um, fix my salad. There's my ground turkey. There's enough for two salads there. And I'm going to eat. Hey guys, it is Sunday morning. And it's about mm, 20 degrees out. You can see that the lake is frozen over. And the dog is barking. Shiva. And yeah, she is about to knock the fence down. Stop. Oh. Well, that rock almost derailed the whole day. All right. Um, I'm going to take this with me to the antique mall, which is where I'm headed shortly <coughs> this is our we haven't been out here in a long time this is our storage area and yeah um we got stuff to work on this piece is already done but we're having issues with this knob because of the way the dresser is cut i don't know i'm ready to repaint that it's been oh my gosh how long has it been maybe six seven eight months since i did that we got some cool pieces in here this is a cool piece this is like that piece that i did last week um i'd have to take off the well yeah, I'd have to take off that rooster. Um, but yeah, I'm going to... Uh, honey super loves that piece over there. And I love it too, but it's too cold and it has to be sprayed. <coughs> I'm actually digging, wanting to do these chairs. And I had somebody the other day message me and want to buy two. And I was like, no, I think I want to sell them all together. So as
as soon as we have a decent day, I'm I'm gonna mess around with these chairs. But right now, I need to locate our personal cart, get this loaded up, and take this with me. <laughs> Looks kind of funky because it's two big pieces sold last night. So I am here to rearrange. We'll see what kind of, hopefully, magic I can do. So I just spent about 10 minutes. That's it. Reorganized. Moved some stuff around. Made it look fresh. <clears throat> so a lot of these doilies. We need to take those out. And we've got to reorganize all the stuff up top. Hmm. Sold a couple baskets yesterday, but I don't see which ones are missing. And I'm going to take that out and I'm going to repaint that. Here's the bench. Move the sewing machine to the front. And I'm taking the cards because the cards had been sitting on that right here. <clears throat> I'm going to turn this. Um, yeah, I'm definitely going to take that home and repaint it. There's a basket wall, but it's like so hard to get the baskets down. We have to reorganize that. Taking this box home, and I've got cards here. Here's a view of what things look like at 10 30 this morning this is the bottom of the hutch it's got to get flip flipped over <laughs> he's going to put a kick plate around it i think this is going to be the island Ugh, i don't know that's definitely where the sink goes the dishwasher goes there there's a Lazy Susan piece that goes in there, but Honey's got to run the <clears throat> the water line to the fridge. And then, obviously, that cabinet goes there. <clears throat> um, the top of the hutch piece is pretty much going to go to where that wire sticks out. That's about how high it's going to go. And here it is. In all its glory. Now it has glass that sets in it for the shelving. Um, and then obviously it has rounded door right here. And so all the glass, the, once the doors are painted. Look at this big old piece I missed. <laughs> okay, I'm going to have to touch that up, obviously. Uh, but anyway, once it's on the wall, um, but it's got beautiful glass doors and everything. So once that's all, oh, I just can't wait. It's going to look fantastic. It's going to look fantastic. But I wanted to give you a look at 1030, what it looks like. And um, hopefully I can do a video while the guy's installing. We'll see how he feels about that. Shiva, what do you think? Huh? What do you think? Oh, you think kisses? <laughs> She's such a love bug. Here in a while. <clears throat> Let's see what's going on in here. This used to be a very magical place. Very magical ramp place. I don't know why I brought my purse out here, but I did. This place is a disaster. And the first thing we're going to do is turn the heater on let it heat up out here a little bit take the purse back in the house because i don't know why that's out here and i'm gonna grab my new dewalt sander and bring that in the house and play with it So 
what I, I say we normally do is um, yeah, what we'll get it up there and maybe go in at, the, at an angle and maybe kind of slam it. You think? My yeah. biggest thing is I'm going to be arguing with this. Right. So uh, we can we can get it up over a little bit more on this side to wait for that and then push it over. Yeah, I can I can always I can always maneuver this you know a little bit. So let's get it kind of away from there and if you want, I'll take that side too if you want. I, uh, I'm calling myself with two. <laughs> so, you ready? Not really good to it. All right. Oh my goodness. So, and then what I normally do is, um, this is the strong part, right here. So I just kind of put it right on there. And now, and now that does most of the work for it. So, um, we're going to elevate this side just a little bit for slamming. Okay. That's where these micro adjustments I like to come in here. Yeah. Is it closing that gap? Yeah, yeah, pretty good. A little low, but not by much. Go down a little bit or am I too high? I think it probably needs to go up just a little bit. You want to do a little bit. Right there? Okay. So then the next thing. Alright, so it's a, if it's tied tight to that, that cabinet, mm -hmm. then either the frame of this is a little off level, just a little, or that cabinet is. So I don't know if that's going to bother you much, but um, what are we talking about? It's, it's about maybe an eighth inch or a foot. Let me go look from a distance. A high dollar cabinet with lighting in it. That is <laughs> I can't wait for it to have glass in it. Mm -hmm. OMG. TYL. What's that mean? <laughs> no, it's T T Y L. Oh, okay. <laughs> Ka, honey. Here we go. This is what it looks like. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, that's what I thought. Like at six fifteen p.m. <laughs> oh my goodness, honey's been having a sneezing attack. I have. He has. A mini apple is cold as rotten. What do you think, guys? I mean, we still have a ways to go, but ah! <laughs> I got goosebumps. I'm so excited. This is our island. It's obviously going to look way better than that. The people are coming tomorrow at 11 to talk to us about the quartz Counter. countertops. Um, we opted to leave this. Um, so it's the same distance out from our regular cabinets and he's going to make it so that that's all covered up and you don't see that, um, gives us more counter space as well. Um, you know, there's glass and cabinets, doors and things that need to go in here and you know, all of that. But over here, I'll have a drawer here. There's four drawers here, another drawer here, a cabinet and a cabinet, and then over here, a cabinet and a cabinet, two drawers and four drawers. Over here, there's a drawer there, and that'll be set up for uh, baking pans to go in there. Obviously, this is under the sink. The Lazy Susan, which was already there before, and then I'll have another drawer here and um, that. So, lots of drawers. I'm getting a lot more drawers than I had. Okay. Well, excited for you guys to tell us what you think. And excited for tomorrow to get our countertops rocking and rolling. And they say three to five day turnaround. There is a potential that this time next week we could have a fully functional kitchen 
How exciting is that? I don't know how to cook anymore. I forgot. Is that because I no, forgot? No, I can't wait for you to cook. <laughs> okay. I'm so tired of eating now. Oh, it is the worst. Uh, baby doll made me a burrito the other night, and oh my gosh, it was kind of like melting your mouth, and it's kind of like, where's this been? Yeah. So anyway, we're stoked, and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Morning. It's cold. We're brave in the cold in our pajamas and short sleeves because I left the heat on all night because <clears throat> it took all day. Oh my gosh. Obviously, I left the TV on too. Oh, it's nice in here. Let's turn this off. I had paused <laughs> when I left in here yesterday. Okay. Uh, so, there is my hoard of smalls. Um, I'm going to grab a couple things. A, a I'm going to grab a stencil. I need to find... I need to find a stencil. <clears throat> so, I'm going to go through this stuff and I'm going to find a stencil for the project I want to work on. But what I want to tell you is I've got to gather up some more smalls. I got to grab some rolling pins because I sold rolling pins yesterday. And Honey laughed because he said the other day I was working on painting rolling pins. He's like, I don't know why you're wasting time painting rolling pins. That's dumb. Yesterday we sold two rolling pins. So I took great pleasure in telling that. We also sold some more stuff. So I'm going to probably, I'm going to come back out here after I find my stencil. And I'm going to find some more stuff to pull down and paint because we have to go to the antique mall. Because we sold $277 yesterday. Yes, 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 we did. And there will be more conversation around that. So, I better get busy. Because the countertop people are coming at 11. And then, um, yeah, then I gotta, we got to get stuff loaded and go to the antique mall. And I want to go to Ikea today. So, I'll be back to tell you the rest of the story. She's so funny. Pile of goods that I got done uh, this weekend. Just a few little things we're taking to the antique mall. These, which I did earlier in the week. Um, the people that are doing the countertops just left a few minutes ago and, um, I can't remember if we're going with quartz or granite. I can't remember. She's going to send us some photos. We wanted white with gray and black veining. Um, super, super loving how the kitchen looks super, super way bigger than it was before. So um, really, really, really excited. And they said they um, could install next Monday, which is one week from today. We could actually have a kitchen again. Honey is outside getting ready to spray um, cabinet doors and stuff. The guy, the cabinet guy is going to come and he's going to cover um, all sides of this or the three sides of this that will be exposed. We're going to have an overhang. I'm headed out to Ikea now. I'm going to look for two black bar stools. And we're really, 
really getting to the point where we're going to have our kitchen back. We think she have a banana? Yeah. Area. I love the color. I'm really glad we went with that color. I had picked out a lighter sage, and I, I really am liking this. Oh, you're using the that sprayer? That's what we use for chalk paint. All right. Well, there we go. Super, super, super excited. Now I'm off to Ikea. He's not going with me. I'm doing this. He's doing this. Okay, here we go. Some Ikea. I really needed to get some storage for under the cabinets, in the drawers, in the kitchen. Um, just <clears throat> give the whole kitchen a refresh since it's being massively refreshed <laughs> at a much larger scale. So, I took a trip to Ikea. I wish Honey would have gone with me, but he was busy um, spraying the, the cabinet doors. And he just couldn't break away. This place is so massive. Um, I had originally worn some really nice shoes that uh, had a little bit of a heel and at the last minute decided against those and went with a flatter boot and boy I was so glad. Now we don't really have any dinner wear <laughs> to be honest. We use paper plates. A I really wanted to get some pillows for the living room and honestly I was not happy with any of these selections. They were either bright colors or white. And I liked the thickness and size of the white ones, but I did not want white pillows. No, thank you. Especially with the dogs. She loves to lay on the pillows. Okay, look at those two. Oh, get your fingers out of the way. <clears throat> I don't know if you can see those two sage colored totes. Um. <clears throat> I picked those to go in the cabinets at the bottom to slide so I could put these in and be able to pull it all the way out. And I got home and they were too big. Bummer. Look, a dog area. They didn't have anything worth it. Worth anything over there. <clears throat> so I'm not happy. But, not to worry, there's so much more to look at. Okay, you're gonna hear us talking in this one in the background, but we gotta get stuff. We, we just got, we haven't been able to get down there and really devote a here? lot of time to reorganizing this whole booth. I did reorganize this area and we've sold a lot of stuff. I'm so happy. There's those two mirrors I just we just put in there and the green tote is new. I think there's a couple new things here but things just need to be really reorganized and made yeah. consumer friendly to be able to reach stuff. Um, that little jewelry box is new. 